true, true. It's stupid top player privilege. <laughs> but now and we got. It's kind of a weird thing where secondaries uh, don't count. It's kind of, it makes it very, uh, yeah, very Cause unfortunate. Because I, I made that uh, rule. Now you can sandbag and do you. But now we got <laughs> Ottawa's second best sheet. Ooh. No, uh, Kevin's, I, better. I know, Kevin's, I better. Kevin's better than me, dude. I had to say that just thing. We, so you look, we, you we got all that know that. Calvin's the best sheet. No, it's Kevin, dude. It's Kevin, dude. <laughs> <laughs> but but, but Michael's hot. just. Michael's gotten really good at this matchup, man. Yeah, he's playing a lot of it. He, yeah. he packs the punishing a lot because it made a big difference, I think, because of you know, on the stocks. Nice spare. Ooh. Run off Nair. Nice edge guard. That was a great edge guard by Kevin. See, I would have personally, like, what I've started to do is run off uh, soft back air, like soft hit reverse bear. Yeah. Because sometimes if I miss the drop zone Nair, I'm, I'm guaranteed dead. But it's it's all a preference. As long as you give them that little love tap, yeah. that's all that matters. I mean, what's better about the bear is that you let, you generally don't trade with the bear compared to the just because the hitbox. As long as you get the right hitbox, right? Because it's disjointed. Don Don left after game one, played his set, and then came for the end of your yeah. set and commentated it. That's because your set took way too long. Ooh. Oh, she went for another up smash. Okay, nice down smash. He's gonna do it again. He should. Oh, oh he should have done. A, he could have done a runoff again. Yeah. I it's, it's sometimes just learning how to commit. You're just. You don't want to overcommit, or you don't want to. You know, it's the risk to reward. If he if he butched that edge guard, he could have been dead at 23, and he's down. So sometimes you don't want to be going out there for that edge guard. Yeah, that one's a little bit tricky too because it was a lot closer, so it would made it a little harder to hit in there. Mm -hmm. uh, I know you want. He probably wanted the fair instead of the downer. Missing foot though. Uh. Big thing here is like he just needs to kind of continue converting off his combos. Like he's ending it a little early, I find. Like he'd go for he'd go for like a down smash when he can hit, just actually with down uh, dash tap, mm -hmm. and then that would make a huge difference in terms of ending the ending the stock. When Michael was doing that pillar combo on Sheik, he could have uh, had a down smash on that side platform, but he decided to keep it going with the up tilt. Ooh, nice read. Oh, no, the, the snipes. Oh, Kevin's, Kevin's sick. The, uh, the Kevin's sniper, sick. Right? Damn it, Kevin. <laughs> PR, PR sniper. <laughs> PR sniper. That's my Ain't job. Kevin, <laughs> Kevin, I have one thing in this world, and he's taken away from me, Ooh, dude. Kevin's sick. Really good. Let's go. Okay. Uh, let's there. Okay, we got last stock here. This year we're even. Kevin's got to get a grab. He Grab him, for, Kevin. Yeah, he went for the, went for the shield guy. I think <laughs> in those cases, yeah, he went for like a read. I think it might be better actually just to wait him out and see what he does. Like, yeah. you want to react to the jump rather than try to read the jump because you're invincible, right? You have no reason to read the jump. Got that much. Ooh, Ooh, the tournament. Out. I hate Sheik's tournament winner. Yeah, it's, it's a really it's just bad. Sheik tournament winnering, even when it's on accident, it's just so Ooh, bad. No that jump. Was, uh, that was a really bad there. But he should he should not have down out there. I mean, he he's has the. He's sure right now, but he had, he had a better option. Put his on off stage. Ooh. Let's dash that forward kill. Okay. Kevin's got to hit him with the signature gimp right oh. now. Oh. He went for, he went for, he went for a Savon read right there. I don't Kev think he recognized that the Michael was next to the platform. I don't yeah. know. It looked very ambiguous, right? Okay. Oh, that shoot. That poke to the platform. Don't do it again. Okay, Kevin's got to hit him with a nice edge guard here. He's got to hit him with a nice... Come on, Kevin. Out of shield or, uh, get a grab. Right. Oh, oh my god, grab wish. the F smash. Oh, misses the uh, the tech chase. DI oh. behind. Misses the snipe. Uh, kill. Found someone else, honestly. Oh, you could have neared out a shield there. Yeah, double dip, that's yeah. it. Bit unfortunate. <laughs> Michael uh, with the double uh, the, the pop off. The <laughs> little, little pop off. I mean, I he has reason. Uh, Kevin's good, so like. It was a close game, too. It was. Kind of pick probably. Probably, if he doesn't ban Battlefield, you go to Battlefield. If not, yeah. uh, Dreamland or Yoshi's. Mm -hmm. He didn't. Oh, I, now I'm triggered because Mike only bans Battlefield against me because <laughs> he knows <laughs> it's a meme. He knows it's, a, it's obviously a good stage for Sheik, but he always bans it against me. Damn it, Michael. Bans it against him, too. We're, no, we're not different. Oh, no jump. Yeah, good careful. fake out. This is a lot of life dashes, too. I find that Kevin hits ledge dashes in uh, friendlies like all the time, and then misses them when he's playing in the tournament. Or at least when he's getting, maybe when he's getting stressed yeah. or a little nervous. Michael got a nice zero there. Are really good right I think he just needs to start tech chasing him. Yeah? Like, okay, the I reads are good, but he's starting to miss them. I feel like what Kevin has to do is he has to start committing to his uh, tech chases because I've seen him do quite a few times when he gets a knockdown or he's reading a tech. 
Yeah, yeah we know. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Continuing. Uh, when Kevin's doing a tech chase, he's doing run up shield wave dash out of that. What he should be doing is he should just be full on committing because Michael hasn't doing any get up attacks, and I feel like it's slowing down his play and making him a bit more hesitant. Uh, yeah. So that's just me. That's yeah. how. Again, two totally different cheeks, two totally different play styles, but. Okay. All right. Like, look at that shield drop up here. I would never do that. <laughs> yeah, shield drop is so important for Sheik nowadays. It makes up a big difference in terms of uh, starting your call, uh, punish game. Because it, it basically puts your disadvantage situation into uh, literally, you don't mess with Sheik on the platform until they get a shield drop. <laughs> Kevin needs a juicy gimp right here to bring his uh, bring the game back. Yeah. I think he has punish game start too. I think Mike was just in the uh, overwhelming neutral. Uh -huh. Or he's, just, he's been making like small mistakes too that I think he can capitalize on. Which is kind of the other issue. But also when Michael's hot, he's hot, dude. Like, mm -hmm. you can't slow down Michael when he gets good. Ooh. Alright, alright, he's moving. Um, uh, oh, it sucks. I, it just, uh, I just, a piece of me dies inside too, just seeing that. Well, yeah, I know Kevin can be. Uh, he can definitely ledge dash. Of course. <laughs> But so it's just like it's, it's just the blood. Really, like, yeah, it's just really hard Where to I see. find I do the most tournament winners on accident is when I'm like she, when I'm Shino stalling. Because I'm not used to like letting go of the controller. Mm. Uh, okay. I wonder if it, you know if there's like a flow chart for the tech chase because like my my flow chart. I mean like can you position yourself in a certain spot when you're uh, as when yeah. you're coming at a certain percent? Because that like 80, yes. right? You can just dash that. So I feel like you can sway dash back to cover. Tech, oh yeah, that's tech that's towards and taking place by dash attacking. Yeah, that's place. why I understand. That's understanding positioning. That's why I said Kevin should change up his play when it comes to the uh, dash forward shield, then wave dash out of shield. Yeah, right, yeah. I know it's Ooh. I know it's technical, but like the whole thing is is that like you have to commit sometimes. The sh the wave dash out of shield is like a momentum pause. Although you're still moving, you're kind of doubting doubting where he will tap. When sh when if you get if you understand Sheik's box shot, you could follow up with anything. Ooh, and that should do it. Yeah. That is it. That's the roll up and a two. Oh, for Michael. Michael. Yeah. 